Hello, uh, my name is Dr. Mallikarjun Kalashetti. I am a consultant clinical hematologist, hemato-oncologist and blood and bone marrow transplant physician at uh, Manipal Hospital, Old Airport, Bangalore. The stem cell collection uh, from the donor uh, can be of two types. One is the bone marrow uh, stem cell collection. The second one is peripheral blood stem cell collection. So typically in, in bone marrow uh, stem cell collection, what is done is donor is taken to the operation theater a general anesthesia is administered and the stem cells are collected from the iliac bone. Now uh, this may take about two to three hours and uh, largely uh, it's a very safe procedure. There are just theoretical risks because of the general anesthesia. Right. Now in, in peripheral blood stem cell uh, collection what is actually done is the donor is given a growth factor for about four to five days and he is then taken on an aphoresis machine and uh, the, the blood from the donor would go into the aphoresis machine the stem cells are collected and the remaining part of the blood will be given back to the patient right there in the closed circuit so uh, here uh, general anesthesia is not needed and uh, it is just akin to uh, giving platelet uh, donations for example and largely uh, the, the only short term issues with, with stem cell collection for uh, for the donor are when we give the growth factor some of them may, some of them may have bone pain uh, they may have headache but uh, they're well controlled with with medicines that that one gives and from the bone marrow collection uh, their hemoglobin may drop a little for which we usually give them hematonic uh, support and uh, and they may have pain uh, from the iliac bones from where the uh, the the stem cells are collected but otherwise there are no uh, serious short or long term consequences to donor because in, in a transplantation procedure donor safety and uh, uh, do donor uh, care is of paramount importance we do not want to do anything that would harm the donor in short and long term